At this camp, it's all about the fish. Large math bass. That's a red ear. 20 students are spending four days learning all about fishing, biology, and how best to use the abundant natural resources in the state. There is a reason it's called Camp Fish. To get kids interested in fishing. Over the years, there has been a steady decline in the number of fishing license sales, and fishing among younger demographics continues to fall as well. The Mississippi Department of Wildlife, Fisheries, and Parks is hoping to reverse those trends by initiatives such as Camp Fish, where students at the day camp spend time in the classroom. All right, what we're looking at here are fish otoliths or ear bones. And outdoors, where there's plenty of hands-on activities. I lo really love fishing, and my auntie, like, she got me in it, and I'm glad she got me in it because I love to fish and love to learn how to work with fish and stuff like that. 11 year old Sarah Parrish is the only girl in this group and wanted to attend the camp because of a long time love for aquatic life and also to help with her future career goals. My mom took me out to a fish hatchery in Georgia when I was little and I just loved it. I'd like to be a fish biologist. This is one camp youngsters don't have to pay for. It's all made possible through a combination of grants and funding from the legislature and organizers are hopeful that the grants and the funding will continue and increase next year so more kids all over the state will be able to experience fish camp. In Tupelo, I'm Allie Martin, WCBI News.